1-0 victory over Connecticut. Um, Outshoot them 17 to 11. Seven straight victories overall. What were your thoughts on the way your team played tonight? Uh, it was a good win. You know, it's a it's a tough team to play. I mean, they they caused some problems. Um, you know, we outshoot them 17 11, but that's really not a great stat to show what you know what the game really entailed. It was relatively even. I thought we had a bit more tonight. Um, created enough good chances and you know pretty good long spells of possession that. You know, eventually we found you know the right movements in the final third to break them down. So uh, good result. Moro Cicero scores your goal in the 53rd minute. Seems like every time we do one of those, his name is coming up more and more. Right. Is that the way you see it? Is he do, taking on a bigger role sort of every game? Yes. I mean, these interviews they say the same thing. He is a very good player, um, and teams know that when we play and they key on him. But he has some top end quality. Uh, not only is he big, but his ability to scoot out of tight spaces and his ability to understand the rhythm of the game and when to play fast and when for him to take his put his throw on the ball and slow it down. He is growing into a you know a very good player. So I'm happy to see him. Connecticut gets a penalty kick in the 67 minute, 60 second minute. From where we were, it's a big cluster of people. Did you get an explanation on what it was for? I mean, the ref, the ref was close. He was closer than all of us. He made the call. So. If I agree with it or not, it's probably not for interviews. What uh, what kind of lift does your team get when Michael pinches over to the side? The shot goes, I guess, high and wide or right yeah, off the corner? Missed it by a mile. Uh, not converting that PK for Connecticut. What does that do for you? No, I mean, I think it's, we felt, you know, I think the guys felt a little uh, hard done by the call. Uh, I'm pretty far away and don't have a great vantage point either, but. Um, no, the guy missed it, and I think it adds extra belief. It was still another, I don't know how many minutes, we still to see out another 20-something minutes, so the resolve of the group was uh, strong again. Pretty physical in the second half. Was that simply Connecticut desperately trying for the equalizer, or was yeah, the rough play a little big, over the top at all? They're a big athletic team, and you know they have some big boys up top that can cause trouble, but I think you know if a team wants to mix it up physically with us, I don't, I don't have any problem with that. Morrow had a save off the goal line. A little while later, Stanton Garcia had another one. Is there an art to that, or is it just right place, right time, and a little luck? Yeah, smart players know, you know, can anticipate and find good places in the box, in the attacking box, and in, in their own box. So, you know, good guys have a uh, instinct about them to where the ball's going to end up, and Mao and uh, and Stan are both like that. Michael Nelson, five saves, fifth shutout of, of the year for him. Right. Your thoughts on his performance tonight? It's good. It's better continuing to get better. Um, he's growing into it and it was a good performance for Michael again. Seven straight wins. Any concern for you as far as your guys thinking about rankings, thinking about standings? Ranking, rankings don't mean anything. You know, we don't, we don't care. I mean, the guys may see it on Twitter and Facebook and Instagram, I don't really know, but we're not caught up in rankings. Um, it's, that's for you know, for the media to talk about and for schools to put on their websites. But for us, it's about what's next and next to Cincinnati. We got a little bit of time off here with fall break. Uh, you know, we'll give the guys a bit, the, the guys who play serious minutes, they'll have some time to recover and, and regenerate and then straight back to training uh, for next week, preparing for another big game at away at Cincinnati.